Hi everybody, welcome back to the Kid Friendly Video Channel. We're having fun here again with our old Riplash Racer Racetrack. And the Riplash Racers, they fit in these little slots here and you pull a rip cord. It looks like this. And the cars race down the track and go through a loop and they end up to the finish line right here. See it? And we record the ending here. And what we're doing here, folks, is we're taking, um, we have a couple of Lightning McQueens here, a red one and a green one. We painted this yesterday, lime green or, or neon green. And today we're going to paint it the same color as fabulous Lightning McQueen. Okay, that's what we're going to do today. We're going to paint that blue. One coat of blue, put number 95 on the hood. I'm going to race it against Lightning McQueen. And if this is your first time coming to our channel, folks, we have been painting cars since last uh, September 2017. We have tons of cars painted here. Uh, we even have the uh, Miss Fritter, the fabulous school bus of doom, painted in honor of Doc Hudson. And we have Mac, painted as Cruz's Holler. And over here we have actually um, Jackson Storm's Holler, right here, with Jackson Storm on top. See, we painted that. And a whole bunch of, um, there's fabulous Doc Hudson with red wheels. He's kind of rare because the other one we have is fabulous Hudson Hornet with white wheels. Somebody wanted to paint them, but I'm not going to paint them. And all kinds of other cars here. We even have a, seven of these little micro drifters. I'm going to start painting them again soon, pretty soon, someday soon. And over here we have these brand new die cast minis. There's Mini Cruise, Mini Fabulous Lightning McQueen, and Mini Jackson Storm. They're so cool. And don't worry, I'm not going to paint them, guys. I'm just going to leave them just like they are. But well, first thing we're going to do today is we're going to set up our paint. We're painting that uh, Doc Hudson Blue. And then we're going to race it against um, Lightning McQueen and see who wins the race. Then we'll have a bonus video at the end. I don't know what it's going to be yet, so stick around to the end. You'll see the bonus. It's painting one of these cars. I don't know which one it's going to be, but um, stay tuned. You'll see the end, and you can watch the bonus video there. It's a short one, but it's okay. So let's get our paint out and paint that Doc Hudson okay, we're Blue. We're all set. We got our Doc Hudson here, and we got our Doc Hudson paint, which is... Uh, Beautiful blue, actually, it's a perfect match. And uh, this is going to be a very quick video, guys. Just going to throw the throw this paint on and put number 95 on top. This is not going to be one of those fancy die cast like I've been doing all along. And just painting this blue so we can see it on the track, and we can compare the winner versus the loser. Now, in yesterday's race, the green car won because it uh, somehow it looked like it went upside down and fell off the track and landed in front of the red one, and the red one pushed it over. Go back and watch, watch the video. This is chapter two, like I said. If you want to see chapter one, there's a button up there you can hit, and it'll take you back to see chapter one. And you can see what I mean. The car actually landed on the track in front of the red car, and the red car pushed it through. So technically, the green car came through first, but in reality, uh, the red car pushed it through. So there we go, folks. Check that out. I'm just going to have a quick paint job here. People are asking me to make all these different colors of blue. I want to do a zebra, and I want to do a, an orange one. I want to do all kinds of different colors of cars. And I'm going to have a playlist of all these series. And you can click on it and watch them all. They're just having fun here, folks. There is number, uh, I'm going to put the number 95 on the top in yellow in a minute when that dries. Then we'll do the race. So let's come back in a few minutes when that dries. Okay, folks, that car is dry. We're just going to throw our number 95 in yellow on the roof of this thing and then we're gonna let it dry and set up for races 95 this is the I'm gonna put it on the engine hood too fabulous lightning McQueen riplash racer we're gonna set the track up in a few minutes and we'll race it against this car from yesterday and we'll see who wins okay okay that looks pretty funny these aren't the fancy ones like I was doing before so um, if you want to see some really good cars, just go look up and see our other videos back there. Okay, we'll back in a minute and set the track up. Okay, guys, we're all set to put the track back up here. Sorry about that, I hit the track with the, uh, with the camera with the track. Okay, there's my uh, regular Lightning McQueen red, and there's my new um, fabulous Lightning McQueen painted in blue. Okay, let's put that right in here. We're going to have a nice race here. And the way this works is I put this inside the slot right here and I put it to the wheel. Are you familiar with the uh, Riplash races of the big wheel in, in the tire? Uh, the big wheel in the middle and you pull it and the wheel spins and the car is raced down the track. This is one of the favorite uh, race tracks actually. So I'll just show you a quick demo how this works. I'm going to pull the cord and the car is going to race down the track. See? And then we get to get to the big loop here. They're going to fly through the air. There's an air gap here of a couple of inches. They're going to fly through that and land down here and come out the finish line. So I'm going to show you the start and then I'm going to do another one and show you the finish. So we'll see who wins. Okay, let's get this set up again. Okay, we'll launch, lock it in here, lock it in here, and I'm going to move the track back a little bit so you can see what happens in the loop. That's the most important part. Okay, 
You ready? Here goes. I'll zoom out a little more if I can. There. Okay, three, two, one. Wow, I have no idea who won that race. I have to watch it in slow motion and um, figure it out later. But I'll do the ending. I'll, I'll do a loop at the end. I mean, a, a video at the end. And I'll set the cars up again. Okay, we're all set to go. Three, two, one. Well, for sure, um, Fabulous Lightning McQueen won because the other car crashed here. So I'm going to do it again. I'm gonna reverse the card. I'm putting fabulous lightning paint on the inside and regular lightning paint on the outside. See? Just like that there. Now the car's gonna shoot down the track and go through the loop. Here it goes. Three, two, one. Wow, that was so tight. I don't know who won. I think fabulous lightning McQueen won. So let's go with that. If I'm wrong, you'll see it in the slow motion replay. Okay guys, that's enough for today, and uh, we're gonna paint the car another color tomorrow or the next day. Just uh, let me know what you want me to do with it, what color, or what will I make it look like. This is awesome. And tune into the bonus video at the end, folks. I hope you like it, and have a great day, everybody. And make sure you hit the like button and share it with all your friends. Robert Thomas, from Thomas and Friends. Now, a lot of people want me to paint this the same color as Lightning McQueen. So, I've already started. Look, I painted the outside of the wheel red, and I'm gonna paint the tires black, and I'm gonna mask this all off and paint it red. And put a big 95 right here and on that side and the back too in yellow letters and it's going to be like lightning mcqueen and it's going to be called thomas mcqueen or lightning the train what do you think should it be thomas mcqueen or lightning mcqueen i tell you thomas <laughs> should it be thomas mcqueen or lightning the train okay you gotta help me out there guys sorry about that so this will be all painted up later so i'm gonna go back now and start working on the tires cover them all black and then I'll mask it off. I already have the top masked and one of those windows done. I'll work on the rest, okay? Let's go back and finish masking them off. Okay, I have most of it masked off now. I'm all ready to um, paint the black on the tires. So I'm gonna do the tires right now in black, right over here. Okay, that's the first three. McQueen style tires and wheels. Now onto the other side. Okay, that's all six of Thomas's wheels. And that's gonna look nice because Lightning McQueen has red wheels and black tires. See? So now when we come back, we're gonna probably mask off the bottom of it we don't get any tape, any paint on the bottom, okay? Okay, the paint is drying the wheels. Now I'm gonna go over and tape off this whole bottom section and get it ready to paint. There, he's all masked off. Now I'm going to lay this on the green paper again and paint it red with my bright red spray paint. Just right here. Okay, we're all set, shake it up. I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but on this side of the train, you can see the number come through there. So I hope I may, I may have to put another coat on that. So we'll have to come back, leave this dry for a while, and come back and possibly put another coat on. Okay, we're back here a couple of hours later, and I want to check this out to see how the side looks. So you can still see the stripes through the side. So I'm going to spray some more paint on this right now, see if I can cover that up. We'll come back in a few more hours and check it again. Well, we gave it time to dry. Let's check it out. There's no way I'm gonna get around that. That's gonna be there. Okay, let's turn this side. See, that's perfect. So let's take all the tape off and see how it looks. Then we'll put uh, number 95 here and here and some lightning bolts. And maybe 95 in the back too. Let's take the tape off.
lightening the terrain looks pretty good. Now let's get the paint, yellow paint, right, 95 here and on the other side, okay? Okay, here goes number 95 in yellow. And we'll cover a stack with yellow paint. I mean, it's water intake. There, so there you have Thomas the Train in Lightning McQueen colors and numbers. Or we can call him Thomas McQueen or Lightning the Train. Thanks for suggesting I paint um, Thomas in Lightning's colors. That was a lot of fun. And I hope you liked the video. Make sure you watch more of them. And I'm gonna put this down right here and put Thomas next to Lightning and next to fabulous Lightning McQueen, Tuck Hudson. Ready to spring mater. Primer Leakless. Primer Chick Hicks. DJ. And who else do we have? Oh, this is the best. This is Zebra Mater. Now for the rest of the video, I'm gonna show you me painting Zebra Mater. Stay tuned. Thanks again for watching and have a great day.